Good morning students. Welcome back to English Literature class for Standard 2. Once again, today I am going to teach you second part. See, chapter 7, Rabbits, Turnips. See, rabbit, no? Rabbit is, what the rabbit is doing? Rabbit is hopping. Now what is this? Turnip, no? What is turnip? Shalgam, no? And this is donkey. And this is small hut. Okay? In the last class, we learned about rabbit and the donkey and how they care about their friends. Rabbit shares his turnip with donkey and donkey then decides to share the turnip with goat. When donkey takes the turnips to goat's house, he is not at home. So, donkey leaves it at the door. Now, let us continue with the story. Soon, goat returned home with a cabbage. So, goat comes back to his home with a cabbage. It means he has found some food. He saw the turnip by the door. Dear me, said goat. Goat sees the turnip near his door. He is surprised to see the turnip. Someone has lost his, a turnip. It must be dear when she passed this way. I should return this to her. Goat thinks that the deer must have lost the turnip when she passed through this way. He wants to return the turnip to deer. Goat then rolled the turnip to deer's house, but deer was not there. So goat takes the turnip to return it to deer. But when he reached there, deer is not at home. So goat left the turnip by the door and went back home. So goat leaves the turnip at the deer's door and returns to his home. Deer came home with the carrot she had found. After goat has gone back, Deer reaches home with the carrot which she has found. She saw the turnip. How kind! Someone left me a gift, said Deer. Deer is very happy to see the turnip. She thinks someone has left a gift for her. But there is no need to keep more than I can eat. But then the deer thinks there is no need to keep more than what she can eat. Otherwise, it will be wasted. There is so much snow. I wonder if rabbit was able to find any food at all. I will give this to him. Deer is worried about, the rab about rabbit. She wonders if rabbit has any food or not and decides to give the turning to rabbit. Deer walked carefully through the deep, deep snow. Rabbit was at home, but he was asleep. So deer is going to rabbit's house with the turnip. Rabbit is at home, but he is sleeping. So deer left the turnip by the door and trudged back home. Deer leaves the turnip at the door and goes back home. Here trudge means move slowly with difficulty due to the snow. The next morning, rabbit woke up early. The next day, rabbit woke up early in the morning. He opened the door and what did he see? He saw the turnip lying by the door. Rabbit opened the door and he is surprised by what is outside. The same turnip which he left at donkey's house is near his door. Now, how has this come back to me? exclaimed Rabbit. Rabbit is surprised to see the turnip. He thinks, how has this turnip come, come back to him? So children, how did you like the story? What do you learn from this story? We learn that we should 
care about our friends and share with them. Okay, you like the story. Bye bye. Take care till we meet in the next class.